Marshal, did he do this to you? Don't say anything. Yeah. You little liar. Go to your room. And as for you, get out of my house! Don't you dare lay a finger on me! I should call the police after what you've done. They won't believe him. He's a little fantasist. He's always making things up. You're nothing but a bully and a bigot. And I've seen you for the hypocrite that you are. Marshal, you don't have to stay here. You can come home with me. Yes, please. You will do no such thing. Oh, you try and stop him? I will not only call the police, but I will make sure that everybody knows what kind of man is chairing the council. Marshal, pack a few things. I'll be here. Marshal! You go through life thinking there's something wrong with you. You know, God's gonna punish you, your parents are gonna reject you, all over something that you have absolutely no control over. No child of mine will be gay. That is not a decision you get to make. Marshal, come here. Tell her. Tell her what? That you're not gay, are you, son? I think I am. Well, your mother will be ashamed of you. Is that what you want? What a disgusting thing to say! Marshall, ignore him. Your mum and God love you very much. I'm, I'm so sorry, Dad. You have nothing to be sorry about. Let's go. You walk out that door, that's it. You're not welcome back here. Good. Have it your way. From now on, you're no longer my son. I wash my hands of you. You don't deserve them anyway. Come on, mate. Oh, all right, on you go. So, but, but you said you'd meet us back here. Yeah, look, I know she did. But it's gotten late and I need to get Dotty to bed. You think everything's gonna be okay? I certainly hope so. She's back. Sorry, I've been ages. Yeah, we were just about to head home. You've got Marsha in the car. Is she alright? He's a bit upset. Where's Dotty? Oh, she's uh, flat out in the back. Uh, what happened? I, I just couldn't believe it. He was covered in bruises. You think his dad hit him? It, some of the things he was saying, I just didn't know what to do. I, I, I didn't want to leave him there. So where's he going to stay? Well, I thought he could come and stay with us, if that's OK with you two. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, I mean, I thought you could bunk in with Archie and Marshall could have your room just for a while, yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah you did the right thing. Of course, he can stay as long as he wants. OK, thank you, both of you. Right, come on, let's go. It's way past bedtime. I'll come in your car. See you back there. Hey, you all right? I told him. I told him what? That I might be, you know. He hates me. He said I'm not his son anymore. Hey, it's going to be OK. We're going to take good care of you. Do I have to go to boarding school? Not if you don't want to. I just need to make a few phone calls in the morning, but as far as I'm concerned, you can stay with us as long as you like. Thanks, Mrs Thomas. Uh, call me Laurel. Might be a bit cramped, but we'll work it out.